Hello friends, welcome back again to my tutorial on Android Framework Components. I'm Dimple here. So in my last video, I had uh, told you all which file and which function is responsible for rebooting the device when we click on the restart button. Now today's session, we will go through which file or which function is responsible for device shutdown or device power off basically when we long press the power button uh, we see these three options and when we click on this power off button our device will be going to shutdown state power off state so which file will do that we'll see so first uh, what i did is i took logs from the logs uh, when i clicked here at that timestamp, uh, I got uh, shutdown, uh, shutdown thread as my keyword. So in my source code, I searched for uh, shutdown thread and um, I came to know shutdown thread is the tag in shutdown thread.java file. So in my last video, I have shown you all how to search a particular uh, file in Android XREF. So this is open source. Um, uh, all the code will be here, Android related code will be here, so we can refer to this anytime to get any clarity. So, shutdown thread.java, this is the file which is responsible for device shutdown when we click on the power button, and this is present in framework based services core java com android server power directory. So, this is the directory and this is the file. Um, so when we uh, search, we'll come to know. So we have to go through the code and we, we have to uh, think which code might be responsible for shutting down the device. So I went through this function, shutdown inner function, and this is the function which is responsible for your device shutdown. So here I downloaded this code. I put a log here, one statement log, and I commented this entire function. And then I uh, built the source code and I flashed this image on my device. And when I checked, uh, actually when I clicked on the power button, nothing was happening. It was acting as if there was no click event. So you yeah, can... Um, See, this is the log I had got. So this is the log we will get. Out of this, uh, the keyword I had put as my name. So inside this function, it was going and shutdown was not happening. So um, <clears throat> in the previous uh, tutorial, I had explained power manager service.java is the one responsible for device restart. I also thought power of might be uh, done by power manager service.java itself but no that won't work inside power manager service.java there is shutdown function but still that is not responsible for shutting down the device it is coming from another shutdown thread.java so uh, we have we have to uh, first uh, suspect which methods or which file may be uh, the cause for this then when we put logs in those particular files and when we build and flash the image and when we take the logs we will get a clear function clear picture of who is responsible so here in this video what i wanted to tell when we click on the power button the function which is responsible is uh, shutdown inner function and it is present in shutdown thread.java power manager service is not responsible for shutting down the device it comes from a separate thread and this is present in this particular directory yeah that's all i had for today hope you all enjoyed see you all soon in my next tutorial until then take care bye